Well, going on. It's Friday. Um, trying to get out of this intersection. It ain't gonna be fun. So, <laughs> I had a, a. This is all business today, right? This is just business shit. I looked and looked and looked for like, I don't know, months now, to try to find a program that would help me put all my expenses, all my revenues, all my all my shit for the detailed business into it, and it would tell me, not all, I don't want to know just did I make money. A brand new fledgling business, of course it didn't make money. I know that already. Um, fucking roads again, man. So, I looked and looked for one, and I found a really good one over at um, Road FS. They make a decent one, but I didn't want to pay that much money for a system that I didn't know how much of it I was going to use, how much of it I wasn't going to use. And everybody's telling me I'll just go grab QuickBooks. But I looked into QuickBooks and it wouldn't tell me what I needed to the point of, I want to know what percent of my revenue did I spend on towels? What percent of my revenue did I spend on cleaners? You know, I want it, I want it that small so that when I'm pricing, I can price accurately. Because uh, you don't use the same amount of towels on this that you do on that, or you don't use the same amount of compound on this that you do on that. This one you may not use none. This one you may use a lot. You need to know what percentage those numbers are. So I'm a, I'm a numbers geek, right? So I said, fuck it. And I built one. I built my own PL system and expense tracker. <laughs> the guy starts giving me shit for it. He says, you know, dude, why don't you just go buy one? So I tried explaining it to him. And what it basically boiled down to at the end of the day is people will buy shit that they don't need all fucking day. And nobody says anything about it. But if you make something that you need, the very first thing people usually tell you is, why don't you just go buy one? Whatever happened to making your own shit? I got a full gym in my shop because I like to work out. Um, 90% of the stuff in that gym, I fucking made. Uh, so, I don't know. I'm not like super successful or rich. I don't have money pouring out of my pockets, but at the same time, I do okay. You know? I don't see what's wrong with making your own shit. So, I guess that's like business lesson, right? If you can make it, don't fucking buy it. I need extensions for a polisher, right? And why pay, why pay $30, $40 for one? Go get some fucking all thread and some heat shrink and make one. Oh, and a coupling nut. You know, I just... I, Maybe it's me. Maybe it's just the way I'm wired. But I don't know. I just I never understood why people buy shit when you have all the abilities sitting in your fucking shop to just make it. So I guess that's the lesson for today. Other than that, it's been a great fucking week. I uh, got a picture up on the gram and on the Facebook of my oldest son Trey, fucking graduating with honors, man. Smart motherfucker. I don't know whose kid he is. Smarter than me. Um, I, I don't know. You can't be more proud of somebody than that when they bust their ass and come out on top, you know? Fucking smart kid. I love that boy. Um, don't get me wrong. I love Dean and I love Magnus too, but right now they're not graduating. You know, they're not graduating with honors. Uh, when they graduate with honors, I'll be just as proud of them. So don't, don't misconstrue that bullshit. Anyway, very proud of my boy. He's not my little boy anymore. He's a grown man. He's leaving for the fucking Air Force. Like his daddy. Smart kid. Don't get shot at. Send the, send the officers out to get shot at. Stay home. But, I don't know. It's been a fun week. Business is a little up and down right now. It's a little weird. So, other than that, it's all good. So, got anything you want to talk about? Let me know. Stay. Sounds detail. Ride clean.